Electronic Arts is the biggest video game company in the world right now. Challenge everything. It was founded in California in 1982, and in 2012, 30 years after its first product hit the market, the company was valued at $4 billion. On the other hand, Axie Infinity was released in 2018, and its in-game currency alone has a market cap valuation of $4.5 billion dollars. Markets, entire economies, and even countries will grow up in this virtual world. And unlike EA Sports, in Tiger Woods Golf, where you earn Tiger Woods dollars by completing rewards or unlocking characters, you can't exchange these Tiger Woods dollars for real life groceries or real life money. But in Axie Infinity, the in-game currency Smooth Love Potion is actually owned by the players and can be traded at any time for US dollars. In fact, Smooth Love Potion is the main income source for some people in developing countries. By playing Axie Infinity, they can actually out earn a so-called real job in the real world by playing a video game. It's actually becoming so big that in the Philippines, the government has started to pass laws on taxing Smooth Love Potion. I learned this on Wikipedia and it quickly flung me down a giant rabbit hole of some very strange but fantastic information. Where people are claiming you can make $500 a day playing these crypto games, and other people are saying it's just one giant pyramid scheme disguised as a cute game. I'm very new to this world, but I'm absolutely fascinated by it. So I spent a week dissecting everything there is to do with Axie Infinity, and I found some interesting things that I need to share with you. So this is the game, Axie Infinity. And it's played with these things, Axies. They're sort of like Pokemon. And you build up a team of three of these Axies and you can actually battle them in order to earn Smooth Love Potion. Smooth Love Potion is the in-game currency and it has actual utility. Because with this Smooth Love Potion, you can take two of your Axies and actually breed them together to create a third Axie. And depending on how rare these Axies traits are, which is randomly generated, you can sell this Axie for a lot of money. At the moment, the world's most expensive Axie is currently listed for $15 million. What? And things get even crazier. Axie Infinity has just announced Axie Infinity Land called Lunasia and there's over a million people playing this game that want a piece of this digital land. This digital land can actually generate commodities and assets that can be traded inside the game for smooth love potion. In fact, you can make so much money by owning some of this land that there's a plot of land up for sale right now at $117,000 for this digital land in this virtual world. And the same plot of land recently sold for $20,000. That is a fantastic return on your investment in the real estate world. But I wanna know if Axie Infinity is actually a side hustle that you and I could pick up to make money. Or could we outsource this daily gaming and turn this into a fully fledged business that exceeds the average nine to five income? And is this the future? Are most people gonna be employed in a metaverse compared to the actual real world in just 10 years time? To answer these questions, we need to start here with exactly how much can you and I make by playing Axie Infinity. So how much money can you make, one, playing the game, two, creating Axie scholarships, and three, trading in-game currency and assets. And of course, we have to address the elephant in the room. The biggest criticism of Axie Infinity so far is it just a giant pyramid scheme in disguise of a cute game. Squeaky. So let's start with option A, or one, playing the game. Let's play the game how it's supposed to be played. So we buy three axes and we build up a team and then we battle them in order to earn Smooth Love Potion. This guy I found did this for us. He played Axie Infinity for four hours straight, including the daily challenges. He put together a total of 196 Smooth Love Potion in four hours. And if we can extrapolate this over a full working day of 10 hours, you get 450 Smooth Love Potions. Or 45 Smooth Love Potions an hour from playing a video game. So what does that mean? What is the exchange rate on a Smooth Love Potion? At the moment I'm recording this, it goes for about 12 cents per potion, or 
$5.40 an hour. But you can see the price of Smooth Love Potion has actually fluctuated between one cent and 30 cents, which is a massive difference and would fluctuate your hourly wage between 45 cents an hour and $13.50 US per hour. Very volatile and not really something you want in a salary. But this strategy is ideal for someone like this guy in Lebanon who is looking to make an extra $20 a week to help out his family. It's not gonna get close to creating financial freedom or financial success in anyone's life, but it is a fantastic start for a lot of people. But that brings us to option number two, Axi scholarships. So let's talk about scholarships. This strategy is basically an extension of strategy number one, but we have people work on our behalf. People are making more money in the Philippines per hour playing Axie Infinity than they could make at a real job. But there is a very high barrier to entry. As we found out, you need three Axies to start battling. And these Axies put together could cost about 2,500 US dollars to start. Enter scholarships. This is where someone like you goes and actually buys these Axies and then you outsource the daily gaming to people in developing countries and split the profit. For example, so you built up slowly 10 teams of three axes through buying them and breeding them. And with these 10 scholars who play on your behalf to earn these smooth love potions, they take 50% of the smooth love potions and you take 50%. You've basically built a machine that prints smooth love potion. Now, Instead of making $5.40 an hour, you're making $2.70 an hour after splitting it with your scholar, but you don't ever have to game and you don't have to spend 10 hours a day playing Axie Infinity. Instead, you have 10 people doing this on your behalf and they can work 10 hours a day each. That means you're making $27 an hour times by the 10 hours that can be played, you could be making 270 US dollars a day. Or if you're really lucky, $675 a day at the peak price of Smooth Love Potion. And this doesn't even include breeding your axes and selling that on a marketplace, which could be very lucrative. The downside to this is obviously the upfront costs you need to actually assemble those axes on those teams and the time spent managing your scholars, making sure that everything is running smoothly. I would say with my research, it's safe to assume you could make a couple thousand dollars a month return on an original 10K investment, assuming the price of Smooth Love Potion doesn't crash. Strategy number three betting on the game. The third and possibly the most profitable way you can actually make money from Axie Infinity is becoming an investor of Axie Infinity. If you believe the game is a winning formula and will be a winner in the long term, you should just buy in-game assets and hold them as they appreciate. Currencies like Axie Shards, Smooth Love Potions, or any land NFTs, for example. If you bought $2,500 worth of Axie Shards instead of assembling a team in January of 2021, today that would be worth $62,000. Or if you bought a land as they started to roll out for $3,000, they today are now worth between $15,000 and $150,000. Now, one of the big criticisms of this game is it's not yet self-sustaining and the money you're getting paid from your bread axes and cashing out into real world money is only from new players entering the game. And if there's no new players actually entering Axie Infinity's world, the price of Smooth Love Potion will crash. Axie is currently working to make this game self-sustaining before this happens, such as finding new ways to spend or burn the in-game currency to avoid overinflation. They're also looking to encourage lots more players to join by announcing a new iPhone and Google Play app so that people all around the world can play from their phone. So if you are investing in this world, make sure you do your own research to see if it's something that you wanna bet on. But there's one thing that's for sure. Instead of actually paying to play games in the future, you're going to actually get paid to play. Whether it's Axie Infinity or any of the new games that are rolling out right now and it's day zero, investing in the right metaverse is a ticket to more money than you could ever imagine. In my opinion, I'm not personally investing in an Axie Infinity scholarship program because I do think there's better opportunities out there in the crypto gaming world. We're in the very nascent and primitive stages of one of the most impactful technologies of our lifetime. Imagine starting an online business in 1995 or signing up as one of the first 10 or 20,000 users of Instagram and posting high quality content consistently. So I've got my eye out right now for projects 
that are going to actually be like investing in Axie Infinity back in January when the price was just 50 cents per Axie shard. If you wanna stay posted with exactly how I am investing my money in this new crypto world and see all the tests that I'm currently running on our behalf, I'm gonna go out there and test all these new ventures, make sure that you hit that subscribe button below. This is a new world, it's very unexplored and it's very risky, so we wanna make sure we stick together out there and we can find the best investments for all of us to join. Let me know in the comments if you have any ideas of stuff that you want me to try on your behalf and I'd be happy to do it. I'll see you in the next video.